It's your boy, Jamie the Gamer. <laughs> I don't know why I start episodes like that. I really like how when you break the lanterns, it sort of it literally destroys the light around where it destroys the light. I think that's cool. Did I go up here? Ah, so this was the entrance of the factory, and to the right and to the bottom is the desert area. All right, what can I do with 14 seconds? Doesn't seem like much I can do here. I've stopped the handles from being built. What do you have to say about that? My plan is working! Nothing can stop me now! Mwahaha! <laughs> no, he doesn't care. I gotta stop the swords. I mean, it doesn't really matter because I've stopped the handles, right? Oh. Hmm. I suppose maybe the handles is the less important part of the blade? I wonder what the guy has to say now that I've stopped the... Now that I've stopped the handles. What do you have to say about that? Finally, some help. Nothing? Alright. Let's go stop the swords! Let's stop the swords from existing because we have to stop the evil pig dude! I wonder what my character's name is. I'm sure the developers gave him a name. I doubt that they would have called him or her Minute. I probably should just say they. <laughs> her is not an afterthought. <laughs> uh, I was watching this comedian called James A. Caster. A. Caster. Um, where he was saying how some people, uh, when they're referring to him or her, sorry, how do I explain this? <laughs> uh, this comedian I was watching was saying how when people talk about gender, they, someone might say, uh, this person, he or she, like as if she's an afterthought. Um, <laughs> and it was funny because you know the obvious answer is to just use the word they. In my head, I've been calling this little little dude a he, though it could definitely be a she, I suppose. I'm more like it's a, it's a very blank template, you know. I like that. I like when games, uh, games like this at least, use a character like the main controllable character as something where you can just sort of impress yourself onto, you know. Like, sure, maybe the developers intended it for it to be a she or a he, but you can sort of choose whatever you want it to be. And I think it's kind of cool. Like. <laughs> I like characters where you can sort of just... Oh, there's more here? You can sort of just... What's the word? Emulate yourself onto it. You know? A bit like Ness from uh, from Earthbound or Frisk from Undertale. I mean, I suppose you can say Ness is definitely a guy. Which is fair enough, but, but he's still such a blank character that you can put your own emotions into it, you know? Hmm... Especially because it's a story-based game. What do you do here? Yeah, I just love games. <laughs> games are great because you can do whatever you want with it. Like in a game like this, there's so much you can do. I'm trying to figure out what to do now, and I'm not really sure. That's okay though, because. I, I'm gonna walk around and hopefully figure it out. Oh, there's a bridge here. The heck? Interesting. I'm trying to figure out how do I get to the swords? Oh, maybe I have to uh, use water? <laughs> hmm. I'm not sure what to do here. This goes to the toilet, right? This goes down here. And I can't do much here. Can I be with the boxes, maybe? Not really. Hmm. My assumption's been that we have to stay in the factory, but maybe not. Hmm. 
but then where do we go if not the factory? Maybe there's something I'm missing down here. Because I destroyed one of those things, right? Shut down the other side. Alright, that implies that I can actually shut it down now somehow. How do I do this? Do I have to go through here maybe? Oh, that would have been cool. Nice little secret. Have I seen this area? Oh, that's the mine! But how do I get there? How do I get to the mine? Um, uh, Heck, I don't know. Wait, huh? Do I need to give you the money? Bro, are you just giving me the shoes without paying? Bro, hold arrow keys to start running. Feel like spending 19 coins for a beautiful heart? Uh, I'm guessing that's what you did with the last little bit. It looked great on you, thank you. But I'm not really, oh, there we go. That's so cool. All right. So it's pretty much you automatically run. I guess because why wouldn't you want to run? I love how the little dust particles come. Alright, do I have to go down to the mine? Maybe. That might be the last place. Hmm. I can't pull. Ah, I accidentally press C instead of X. Hmm. Go over here. It's interesting how they make it so you hold down the arrow keys. How do I get there? I want to break this thing. Can I whack this? No. No? What do I do? There's a place, not this screen, but the one on top that I can maybe go to, which is up here. No, doesn't... What? Wait, how is this game even laid out? <laughs> hmm... I really assumed you had to break this open, but you don't. Is there anything else I can do? Maybe I need the scuba gear? Uh, but where would I get the last guy? And where's the wallet? Is the last guess like on top of the fool? Is that like the thing? Ah, don't kill me. It's nice that I have a lot of hearts though. That means like I don't need to worry too much. I'm thinking maybe I can get the dog guy. I sort of like how the music judders when you cut something. It works in a game like this. <clears throat> wow. Maybe I can go in the back of this place? No. Uh, where would the last guest be? I assume he's around here, right? Like, they wouldn't put him far for no reason. I'd assume he'd be in this area. Still trying to figure out what I have to do with the bone. Hmm. I like the music. What do I do? 
I'm confused to whether I should try keep looking for a guest or if I should keep trying to explore the factory. Because if I look for the guest, then I can get um, I can find this guy's wallet or credit card, whatever he wants. <sighs> Maybe it's in one of these. In here? I don't know. Hmm. Alright. <laughs> Trying to figure out what to do. So I wonder what complaints these guys have because it's not the minute thing. <sighs> Is there a reason why they show me this? I'm gonna have to end the episode here guys, a little bit confused, but hopefully we figure out what's going on next episode. Thank you guys for watching, be sure to uh, like, subscribe, share, all that jazz. Thank you very much, please have a wonderful day.